Hi, thanks for joining us again on Celebrating Act Two for our weekly, what do we call this, Art? A review of, of fill it, help me fill this in here. Okay, two, two old guys sitting in the balcony talking about vintage film movies. Okay, for the vintage film. It must film, be old because I can't remember half this. Well, yeah, <laughs> but that's, I'm reading off a script. <laughs> Uh, so vintage film uh, YouTube slash yep. vintage film channel, right? And vintagefilmchannel.com. Our friend Gracie has curated literally uh, uh, hundreds of old TV shows and old movies right. that she's collected and and rescued and digitized, by the way. So they look great. Um, and she's colorizing too. She's also doing colorizing old black and white stuff. Anyway, today. Art and I have a treat for you. It is the Jack Benny show. Mm. Gracie has, I think, four Jack Benny shows up. Is that right? Yeah, Art? So, something like that. But but what's really interesting is that uh, I, they they're all interesting. This one has Bing Crosby and somebody else famous. Who is that? Uh, uh, well, let's watch. Uh, okay. Let, first of all, Jack Benny's famous f a comedian, right? right. And uh, I think it's Rita Rudner who who made a success copying his look, his deadpan reaction to the laugh of the audience. Right. Um, so this is his stand up. The, you know, the show, what's great about the Jack Benny show is that it was a combination of um, kind of a sitcom and an entertainment variety show. Right. He always opened as, a, you know, even today they do. They open up with a monologue. And um, he was a very funny guy, very successful in vaudeville, in radio. Yeah, as a matter of fact, on radio, just as a note, on radio, I think it ran from 1932 to 1959. They, yep. they had 931 episodes. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. On radio. Yeah. Right. And, of course, the television show, how long did that run for? That ran uh, from 50 to 1950, 1965. That's, of course, what I remember. And yeah, uh, that's they had 240, years, yeah. 245 shows. And during that period of time, for about uh, nine years overlap, the radio show was still there. But, you know, the radio began to die out of that medium, especially yeah. when you had almost identical fare from the same person uh, yeah. on television. But yeah. uh, he read for a long time. And I remember his show. I actually enjoy, you know, it's like the George Burns and Gracie Allen show where George would come on and do a monologue and, and things yep. like that. So very similar to that, except that he had more involved skits, as I remember it, uh, like Birds well, of Island. Well, well, yes. like the, they they did like a, a sitcom of the two of them in their home, as opposed to uh, right. a, a more of a variety show that uh, Jack Benny had done. Right. Well, you know, Jack Benny. I think they all did kind of the same thing. Jack Benny, for instance, go to uh, go to your first marker where we'll see. Uh, Rochester. Jack Benny's yeah, come down uh, show really involved his his regular uh, cast. Don DeFore, I think, it was not Don DeFore, but Don Wilson was his announcer. Here's Jack Benny. This is the beginning of the uh, the sitcom, if you will. Yeah, there's Rochester. And there's, there's Rochester, who was his driver and right hand man, and uh, all of that kind of stuff, and it was a, a real character in it. On so, his own. John, I have to ask you: Do you know who played Rochester? What was his real? His real name wasn't Rochester. No, I know. What yeah, was his real was, name? It was Eddie Anderson, and I never knew that until I did some, some research on there. Yep, but he, you know, he became famous in his own right. Yep, just for being the sidekick to Jack Benny. Right. As a, as a matter of um, fact, just as an aside, because I know we're going to go on to another one of his regulars, but also a number of regulars that are not in this particular show over the years was Dennis Day. Yep. Mary Livingston and Mel Blank. I forgot all about Mel Blank. Yes, he was there. Mel Blank. Yeah. The, the, the trains leaving for uh, Pasadena and Cucamonga. I mm -hmm. always remember that. Yeah. And then I moved to California and found out there really was a Cucamonga. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, go to Don DeFore, the next marker, and uh, he was he was Jack Benny's announcer for many years well, on radio uh, no, it was Wilson. and on television. You, you're talking about and he plays Don not Wilson. Don DeFore, Don Wilson. Don Wilson. Don, Don DeFore is another sitcom. Right. Uh, but Don Wilson played himself, um, and he would do both announcing duties and play a character in Jack's 
life. Right. Uh, so in this particular episode, why we picked this out of the uh, four uh, various Jack Benny shows that Gracie has put up on uh, Vintage Film Channel is because this has a rare appearance of three stars right. uh, together. And so what happens here, the little story is they're looking through a scrapbook. And as they look through the scrapbook, they find an old picture of Jack Benny dancing with, guess who? Yes? Bing Crosby? Yes? And George Burns. And George Burns. Now, the story is, George Burns was the only guy who could make Jack Benny laugh. Mm. Apparently, Jack Benny just, you know, because he was known for that straight face. You'd, he'd tell a joke and he'd go, hmm, yeah, yeah. But this is a great show because you're never, maybe never going to see these three guys together in the same movie again. I don't know if they ever appeared together, really. I think, yeah, I think, I, think I, 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 I began to research, I know that at least two of, you know, Jack Benny and one of the others uh, appeared in something, but I don't think all three of them together. They might have. Right, right. So here they kind of reenact a, a vaudeville uh, skit, if you will. And it's a just a wonderful episode to watch all three of these masters of comedy, um, even though, uh, uh, what's the guy's right on the right, the singer? Uh, he wasn't known uh, necessarily. Cros as, Crosby. Thank you. He wasn't necessarily known as a. <laughs> John, John, but not Crosby and Crosby, Stills and Nash. This is, <laughs> this, this is Bing Crosby. I, I, think, I think our audience knows the difference. Okay. <laughs> But what a wonderful show this particular episode is. You have to go look for it on um, Celebrating Act Two, the YouTube channel, cel pardon me, the YouTube channel, Vintage Film Channel, right. um, or VintageFilmChannel.com. Uh, but go to the YouTube site. Gracie has hundreds and hundreds of old television shows uh, like this and uh, hundreds of movies, great movies that you you'll really love old movies yeah by so. the way uh, uh just as a quick uh, note to our audience if you go to uh either her uh, uh website or the uh, youtube channel and you find one you'd like us to review and do some research on and find out how many shows they've done and things like that and sh because you you liked it so much that you'd like us to share it with the entire audience let us know send us a note yep. at info at celebratingact2.com and uh, we'll be happy to do it and also yeah. please Help help Grace and encourage Grace and us by subscribing to our YouTube channels so that um, uh, we look more important than we really are. Yeah, and and don't make us beg for the subscriptions. I mean, that's not a pretty. Story. No, no, I can. I'll, I'll I I know how to beg. I'm in charge of begging, John. You're in charge <laughs> of forgetting who that guy on the right was. <laughs> yeah. And w w when you go to uh, Vintage Film Channel on YouTube. Uh, be sure to look at all four. I think there are four mm. Jack Benny shows that Gracie has put up. They're all marvelous in their own right. They're all wonderful entertainment. Um, and this just seemed to me to be the quintessential when you get these three guys together. It's right. a rare occasion. Uh, by the way, over the years, they've had virtually every major uh, person of their times, like the, the uh, Bob Hopes and so on and so forth. Yep. You'll find them all on the Jack Benny show, not necessarily on the four samples that uh, Grace has, but it was really a terrific show. And uh, uh, one of the things that uh, Vintage Film Channel does for a lot of people is it has this wonderful sampling of these things. So then you finally say, you know what, I think to see like another 30 episodes. Well, yeah. th now that you've liked this one, you rem reminded yourself how much fun this was, then you can go to the internet and find the rest, you know, that are wherever they're located. Yeah. Anyway. And keep watching, keep watching vintagefilmchannel.com and keep watching celebratingact2.com and we'll see you soon. We'll see you next week in the balcony. There you go. For more on Celebrating Act 2, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life.